Alright, hey, hi, hello, how's it going guys? My name is Theodore Rezod and welcome back to more Midnight Fight Express. Now, before I begin, be sure to like, subscribe, and get the bell on so you stay up to date on all my latest videos. So, last we left off, we were going after someone called the Chef, I think, if I'm not mistaken. But basically, he's harvests, he harvests organs and he sells them off to the black market and all that jazz. Uh, we managed to f defeat him, he had a flamethrower, but we also found out that Droni is actually our son. So, surprise, surprise. Didn't really expect it, I wasn't really thinking much about our son, to be honest. <laughs> but yeah, so there we have it, Droni's our son. Um... I don't know what else is there, there is to say, but basically that's it. Um, again, I don't really care about the clothes, so let's just move on. Game Studio. Chef Favreau's dying words reveal, revealing a child-parent relationship swirl around in the minds of baby fist Droni, yeah. But Droni knew that. I did. Sharp weapons can, can kill targets instantly when thrown. Alright. Cops mobilizing, we gotta find some cover fast. Tactical meets SWAT, so there really ain't. Ah, oh, come on. Fortunately, looks like this part of town hasn't been hit yet by takeover. Our efforts must have slowed him down. Let's count that as a win while we look for a place to hide. Alright. Something's going on over there. Let's check it out. Oh dear. What the hell? You know, you're wearing shoes, the game devs. <laughs> Yo, you here for the launch party of our game? Are you Jim's partner? We heard so much. We heard so much about you. It's just a little underdressed for festivities. Our game's all about petting animals, no killing whatsoever. And since it's a midnight launch, we figured jammies and animal onesies were the way to go. Lucky you, you're just in time for the main event, pillow fight. Oh, I'm actually getting hurt though. Well, when in Rome. Can I just shoot them with my gun, though? <laughs> oh my god. I can't shoot them with my gun. Throw the pillow. I can't throw the pillow. One. I think I broke his head. I think I broke his face with that pillow. Hey yo, that's cheating. Can I throw? I can't throw the pillow. Woo. This is wild. You might want to go a little easier with these, those pillows, though. Why don't we try to find a quieter spot upstairs to hide out? Playing the game. Alright. It's all fun, nobody dies, nobody dies. Now listen up all. Hope you're having a great time tonight. We should all be super proud of what we built here. A 300 hour AAA game built in just under 6 weeks. Give yourselves a pat on the back. That's freaking impossible. <laughs> And also, don't get too comfortable tonight. We'll be kicking off production the next one at 8 a.m. sharp. We have a new investor in the form of our city's coolest and most philanthropic hero, Jeff Kingsworthy. He expects a sequel in half the time of the original. I know it sounds crazy, but if anyone can do it, it's all of you. Okay then, let's get back to having mandatory fun for a few more hours. Woo! Oh shit! Sheesh. Jeez, is there anywhere here where we can get some peace and quiet? Let's try the top floor. Okay, I got a small little gun. Some of you may be wondering, what's about the what's with all the grow rooms filled with weed? Aren't we a game studio? Well, with our new investor Jeff Kingsworthy on the board, we also now, we're also now a girl house. We need to figure out how to mix the two, for tax reasons. Ideas? 
farming game where you cultivate marijuana and date individual anthrop anthropomorphic wheat plants. A VR experience where you simulate smoking weed while you actually smoke it. No real gameplay, but we call it game for sales. Uh, am I the only one concerned with being strong on by a mobster here? He's gonna get thrown out the window. <laughs> it's a meme! <laughs> it's a meme! That's funny as shit. Got a lot of pent up anger. Ow! Ow! Stop it! I think we must have knocked them all out at this point. Finally, some peace and quiet. Who's that? Listen, about that whole family thing. I'm sorry. It's a little tough for me to say, apparently. Okay, here goes. I'm your... That's real guns. Introducing SWAT. Okay, team. Surveillance shows Babyface was last, last seen entering this building. Proceed with extreme caution. Shoot on sight and shoot to kill. Do not damage the drone. Boss's orders. Go, go, go. You're freaking kidding me. We just can't catch a break. I'm assuming these are the real developers of the game because they have all sorts of weapons here. That. You're good, but SWAT is lethal. We gotta go like 10 minutes ago. Oh, hey, you're here to watch? Remote capping the animal dance performance in the game. This is where you get to pump your fist in a club setting alongside your favorite animals. Tonight, we're capturing the giraffe dance. Here we go, pump it! I guess that's the developer. <laughs> Poor guy, he looks so stressed out, especially that guy. He's all white and pale. Quick, Team 2 is waiting for us in the slums. Apparently, they need some kind of pushback against Mission Killitary, and we need support. Let's go around and find Babyface, we can get out of here ASAP. Rolling. Oh, wow. They're really armored up, huh? Stop it. Oh my god. Eat pillow! Oh! No, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Oopsie! <laughs> I meant to throw my pillow and I shot him in the face by mistake. No, no, no. Let's use the magnum. Wonder if this will hurt them. Oh, it does. Alright. Grab the gun, let's go. They're armored though. Got you now, butthole. Oh, Pillow Man. I will win this thing. Pillow Man shows no mercy. Where you go, Pillow Man. He doesn't look like he's doing too well. Ooh, maybe I should have done that. Fighting each other. Ah! All those pills are well, like tanking the shots. <laughs>
Alright, that'll do it. Okay. It's time to bounce. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Sap. Alright. It's definitely going down as one of the weird experiences of my life. But hey, we got a lead! What if this mission killed Terry is? It doesn't sound good. It sounds a lot like attacking the military, but not as we part of the takeover. Let's grab one of those SWAT trucks and hit the slums. I promise we'll talk about we'll talk about the family thing. Soon. Why can't I keep my weapons? Okay. Um Hmm. Heavy roll, uppercut, circle, and then hold hold square. Oh, I forgot I had a heavy attack. Maybe that's why my, my shots are just bouncing off. Okay, let's recap real quick because we have thrown a lot at us, your ghost. So this drone isn't just some random talking drone. It's a real person working with from within the King Kingsworthy's org. That's the guy, by the way. The one we mentioned before, the saint you claim is a monster in disguise. You got the loyalty, sure, but... Crazy claims about philanthropists like that of his question your sanity, ghost. And now you're telling us not only is this drone an actual person in the chair, but they're your kid too. Sounds like a real crockpot of slow coke bullshit. You hit that one already, Agent McClune. Oh, my bad. Sounds like a... Come back to me. I think what my partner here is so poorly trying to say is this story is pretty far-fetched. Especially when you're a criminal levying claims against someone as visionary as Mr. Kingsworthy. Now, why don't you continue on? Just dying to know what the next big twist is you're... And your re very real story is. And the next big twist in your very real story is. I feel like that's not grammatically correct, is it? Or maybe my brain just can't comprehend right now. Swat, baby. Block the roads. Damn, roadblocks. The streets just aren't safe. The fun is for sure if we stay up here. Let's grab the next train. Should get us where we need to be. Oh, it... what are you doing? Oh shit, babyface, right? I remember you. I used to work for the boss as personal waitress. You attended some of those dinners. The boss really dug my work ethic, put me in one of his gangs. Makeup's a little much, but I finally get to be what I always dream. Street performer. Gang's a little crazy, but who isn't these days, am I right? Anyway, good to see you. Stop by again sometime. Alright. What the hell is going on? Introducing the crazies. Oh, hello, bub. Oh, hey now. It just happens to be the poor and fortunate soul we're hunting. Thanks for delivering yourself right to us. Oh, God. That's creepy as all shit. Nope, nope, nope. Stranger danger. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Please go. Please go. Stop it, you freaks. You're crazy. Oh god, I'm uh, dead already. How are they jumping around like that? That's crazy. One down. Shit. What the hell just happened there? Ah, crap. Go away. Stop it! Oh my god, those things are annoying! Dead, anyway. 
Oh, she dodged that. Shit, I missed. I don't want to deal with these freaks. Ah, uh, uh, more. Uh, I don't know who the hell these crazies are, but I don't want to stick around and find out. Let's barrel through them so we don't miss a train. Yikes. Special delivery! <laughs> Trains at the platform here. Oh, blew himself up. More crazies. Hello. Tickles the cloud. Have a nice trip. Oh, man. Burn, baby, burn. Tickles has a knife in his freaking face! What a champ! One more knife! Holy cow! Happy to that. Goodbye, Tickles. Ooh, he even sounds like the Joker. Oh my god! Introducing the faceless. Oh, you're kidding. Creeps. Don't go far now, precious. We'll be back for you in a minute. Uh, pass. I don't want this. It's train to danger. Ah, crap. Go away. Train, no time to waste, get on. Oh, here. What a bunch of freaks. Oof. Jeez Louise. I just want my normal bullets. I just need six magnum rounds. Watch me go to town. <laughs> Break enemy blocks using powerful kick in the nuts. Ooh, L1 finisher. Yeah, let's do that. What if they're women? They don't have testicles. That's not biologically possible. Right. Okay, so this mission kills everything. We ain't got much to go on other than some slum gangs form involvement. Means we gotta find someone this hellhole's got knowledge of thing and beat it out of them. Unless they're willing to be diplomatic, of course. Who knows? Maybe we get lucky. A little optimism never hurts. Hey, buddy. Look at this mess. Nobody cares about this place anymore. It's just lunatics now. I grew up here before these psychos moved in and took over the place. My sister and I got out, but my mom wasn't so lucky. Come back from time to time. Helps to, remem helps to remember her. Hard to imagine this place getting better if everything that's happening. Hopefully one day.
Brothers, the enemy is upon us. The Dark Lord has gifted us this knowledge. We mustn't falter again from the way of the Dark Lord. Do not be swayed by the False One. He will not be father for his bidding. Let us go forth now and defend our land from the heathens who seek our servitude. And remember, sacrifice is the only truth. The Brotherhood. <laughs> Shit, that guy had a shield. Yeah. That. Ah. Oh, am I angry? I am angry. down. Oh, these guys may actually be nuts, but I'm not letting go of that optimism. One of them will talk, I'm sure of it. Let's keep searching. Alright. Gotta use the Magnum. Oh, it's SWAT. SWAT again. Let's avoid him, yeah. The moment they know we're here is the moment they'll, they'll be on our ass too. And look, I realize we haven't had a moment to catch up yet. We're short on time as it is. I'm just gonna say it. Chef Favreau, Chef Favreau wasn't lying. I'm a kid. And it's like a whole thing. With complicated emotions and all, didn't really feel good to be abandoned by you, you know? I know. I should have told you sooner, but honestly, it's painful. And we don't need distractions. Saving the city is more important right now than whatever we got or not between us. So let's focus on that, and when we got a minute, we'll get to rest. We'll get to the rest together. All right. We're sacrifice ready, brother. Remember the will of the Dark Lord. May your sacrifice shatter the bones of many. Thank you, brother. Remember me. Tell tales of my bravery and service to the Dark Lord. Blow yourself up. Uh, okay, brother. I'll definitely do that for sure. Now get out of here. Get out of there. Make the Dark Lord proud. Oh. That was a waste. Oh, I did a bane on him. Oh shit, I didn't realize that guy was a blowy up guy. That's a really high jump. Shit. <sighs> All right. And this stick's still with me. Where do I? Oh, here. Go shit bag. Boss is pissed, you know. Now tell us where your, where your cuckoo puffs leader is, or you're gonna eat lead. Okay, okay, I'll tell you. But you can't say anything to the other, other brothers, so I'll exile me. Fine, spit it out. Fatherhood's in the northmost shack. Now please let me go. Sure thing. I'll let you go. Straight to your precious Dark Lord. I believe. Northmost shack, okay. Lose our lead on this whole operation. Let's go. What was that? Blind devotion is a hell of a thing, huh? Imagine killing yourself with some misguided ideology. No thanks. 
imagine that. Like the knife, the sharp objects they always do really well. They do more damage, I'm, but I'm assuming conversely, they don't have a lot of yeah, they're probably not that. Uh, Ooh, they are. If you kill fatherhood for me, that saves me the time, you know. Don't move fast, let's fly. Yep. Yeah. Na -na -na. Hello. <laughs> Surprise, fatherhood. Stay back. The dark one is spoken. We'll take no part in your operation. Oh, buddy, we just want to talk. Not today. Ooh, shit. I just did SWAT's work for them. Quick, check the computers. There must be something in there. Oh, it's hammer time. Oh, we've worked. There's a lot of info here. Oh, boss is out of the Russian mob. Planning a major attack on the number of military bases outside the city of tomorrow. Taking thousands, they were talking thousands of lives, man. More lives. All to prevent military intervention of the city takeover. Gotta stop this before it starts. Okay. Once the city's largest casino, let's start there. Figure out exactly how this is supposed to go down. Grab the trunk, get the hell out of here. Aw, but I want a golden AK. Yeah. Death bonus. Yay. C though, I'm never gonna get an A. <laughs> I'm just not that good. I maybe it's gotta be like if you use a bunch of combos and stuff. I might still just buy it all up. Okay, but I think now's a good time to leave this episode off here. We're 20 out of 40, we're halfway done. Um I think it's just gonna be us kill keep killing people, so let's keep going and see what happens. But for now, if you like what you see and you like what you hear, be sure to like, subscribe, and get that bell on so you stay up to date on all my latest videos. As always, be safe, take care, and I'll see you when I see you. Peace!